Delhi had become a city where it was difficult to sit out like this. Pollution was come to level which was about the highest in the world. There was not a care by anybody or any department to plant trees along with houses. We had to sit up and see what we could do about it. We have to do this for a better tomorrow. Without a river, life does not exist. This is the river basin which supports life in Delhi. If we had come here five years ago, before this park was created, what would we have seen? You should have seen only what you call barren area barren. with uh, a salt uh, crust on the surface. So there was no plants here? Really. Nothing, nothing. Nothing could grow? No. So in a short period of time, less than five years, you've been able to create this beautiful environment. Right. The entire river basin used to support luxuriant floodplain forests. Hmm. Over a period of time, all these forests vanished. Because of development? Housing complexes. Housing, industry. Industry and so on. We have grown native grasses. These grasses harbor a large number of microbes in their root system. So you have a plant that is essentially taking the salt out of the soil and then other things are able to grow? Yes, right. We are planning to bring all the vanishing species back into the park. 3,000 species, native species, which used to exist once upon a time. This is a greenhouse. What's happening here? See, here we develop saplings. We have now around about uh, 50,000 saplings which will be planted next year. The entire trophic structure in an ecosystem depends upon the plant species. This will provide a fairly large amount of oxygen. Take away the pollutants. They also purify the water systems. When you walk around here, an area that five years ago was barren, and now you see the ducks, the water, the trees, the beauty, how does it make you feel? If you have a will and a commitment and have a vision, you can create miracles in India itself. <laughs>